Well, guys, I'm back to my GTA Liberty City Stories playthrough as my bike before the first mission is still there after I got this bike from doing the first mission, too. That's insane. But anyway, time to continue on doing some more missions for Facenso, or however you pronounce, because I don't know much of the characters out in this game since I haven't played hey. that much. Oh, for crying out loud, Tony! Don't I get any peace? I'm already all blocked up. Last thing I need is you on my case. Oh, but it's just still here. You know, I'm still not seeing any money coming in from that dealer. You know why? Enlighten me. Because he's dead, idiot. Some chump whacked him. The Sindacos have started dealing. And on Leone Turk, too. You gonna accept that, Tony? I want you to get over to Chinatown. All right, boss. I'm on it. Oh, for God, why is there never any goddamn paper in here? <clears throat> right. So now let's get back on my original bike. Ouch. Side right there. Ah, uh, of course Chinatown where the triad's at. Oh man, they were very annoying once you um, kill their leader in free. Oh, and speak with, oh god, the one mission in free, we had to kill like 25 triad members with the flamethrower. Oh my god, it's broken in, in the definitive edition for a switch. Like, none of them spawned to do it. It's really annoying. It took me like a week to get it done. Stay off Leone Tarp, asshole. I'm holding R. You want some more, asshead? Hey, I ain't just some wimp. Well, didn't, didn't say how I have to do it. I have a gun, so I'm not supposed to be having a gun. The Leone's dealing this city. Nobody else. You hear me, you Sindaco fucks? Which is funny because while going through Vice City again, the um mob, the mobs and um. The Mafia for out on um, Liberty City don't do drugs, except the Ferrellis, which of course Sonny is the leader of in Vice City. So now all of a sudden, now they're doing drugs, which is weird. And here we go. Took a little bit of damage there, unfortunately. As I'm still... Oh wait, no, it's this way. There we go, got the armor. I think I finally started to get the armor cheat figured out and all that. But hey, uh, another mission done. That was fun and all that. Nice to have an actual lock on that works, unlike, you know, in free. But hey, the Definitive Edition definitely fixes free up so much that I will only play the Definitive Edition of free and never play the original whatsoever, because that was really bad. Alright guys, so that's going to wrap it up here. See you all next time.